Thanksgiving of 2012 will always be known at Farrington High School as the day the roof caved in. A 40-foot section of the auditorium crashed to the ground after heavy rains. The good news, no injuries. The bad news, no auditorium. So it was uh, devastating because it took four years and so basically four years of our activities stopped at that point. And after four years and nearly $12 billion, renovations for the Joseph Ryder Farrington Community Auditorium are finally complete. It's, it feels very overwhelming because we finally get to use the auditorium and plan events in here because we usually use the gym. The old auditorium had been around for 58 years and was in the process of a 10-year renovation project when it collapsed. When they looked at it, there were some um, structural kinds of stuff that happened. Um, so I think it was a combination of stuff, um, whether with the weather at the time. After years of rebuilding and renovation, state lawmakers took a look at the new auditorium, which will be home to Farrington High's theater program, band and orchestra concerts, assemblies, ceremonies, and more. We had even homecoming events in here just last month, and um, it's just been like old times. It's just been great, the excitement, um, the pride is back in here. Besides a new classroom and media center, the auditorium will also house graduations for Kalakaua and Dole Middle Schools. Lindsay Fukano, KITV Island News.